There's Josh Schuster. Be interesting what side he plays on the field. He's predominantly a left side player. Well, Kieran Foran's pretty much been a left side player his entire life. So it'll be interesting, but his ball skills are absolutely incredible. One of the real superstars of the game. Yes, no doubt about that. What an impact he's made. He's still eligible for Rookie of the Year status as well. So if he can stay fit, for the first time we've seen him since the victory over Parramatta in round 11, he'll be making claims for that. We're underway. This match was slated for Brookvale We're on the Gold Coast instead. Wherever you can find a ground, we'll play at the moment. And Jack DeBellin has taken high in the first tackle of the game. Five metres out, centre field, McCulloch, Hunt. Nice ball that to Bird, who rolls it to the end goal. It's been forced here by Manley in awkward fashion, but a positive start for St George Illawarra. Now Foran on play five. Tyrell Sloan under the pump. Oh, good tackle by Saab. There's not much of him, but he stood his ground. That would have been teammates through the junior rep system. Yeah. Jason Saab and Sloan played in the 20s. Holding Cup together. It's a great story. I, I wanted to highlight that because there's a lot of negative press around the game and, and some of it the players and, and others bring upon themselves. But there's so many good stories like Tyler Sloan. And I reckon there'll be a heap of other players like that as well. Jack Bird down the sideline. Gets a pass to Sloan. He's up against oh, Ruben oh, Garrick. Yeah. He says goodbye, Ruben. And Tyrell Sloan in his second game scores his second NRL try. Well, he's an exciting young talent. And the Dragons moving the ball out of their own end of the field against a compressed Manly line. Jack Bird's able to get around them. Harvey Norman replay. Some nice play here. A little offload. Gets the ball out to Jack Bird who's standing wide. He's able to get around Bragg Parker. Back inside to Sloan. Watch this for a move. See you later, baby. Uh -huh. Never even looked like worrying about him. See you later, baby. Now Jack Bird's kicking. It was an easy one to start. Leading point scorer in the comp with 186 at this stage of the year, Ruben Garrick. To power, one-handed offload. Back to Croker. And then through Schuster, it comes out to Olakawatu, who left one tackler behind there and slid a ball away to Morgan Harper. What a talent. Hamoli Olakawatu. Well, just like the Raiders game last week, the Manly attacking game looks very clunky but then you've got these big men on the edges who are just brilliant with footwork size and the ability to unload the ball once again Schuster just got the ball and things happen around him he threw it early this time but somehow they've just got to keep getting themselves in a position where he's got the ball Oh, there's a couple of highly paid and high profile ball boys on the sideline. We've got a couple of warriors. <laughs> oh, look at this for a charge. He's had a start as well, Moses Surly. He's a talent. He looks fit, doesn't he? Croker, Schuster. He wants Saab to put a leap up, and he'll do that. He'll tap it back. Now, Harper, he can stick a boot on it. This is going to sit in the end goal. Oh, he's got to play it at Sloan. Good play. Kepi, it was a dusty play the ball, that one. And way to Foran. And now Schuster, look at St George's defence. They're going back. You can't go back when Ola Kawatu is on the rampage. Five in five, Ola Kawatu. Once again, the man Schuster control on the right-hand side. Only need a tiny little bit of momentum. The Dragons' defence will caught in their heels on the Harvey Norman replay. I wonder what he thinks about as he stands in there. I think he's looking at the big screen if he, if he can. Ah, good kick, Ruben. Another one. Lawton, the defender. And a couple of metres short. McCulloch, they're going to try the power play again. They're going to get there. They're going to score. Josh Maguire. He looked at me, saw a lot of space around the goalposts. And the Dragons, middle men saw it as well. They all come off the lines, staggered. A couple of experienced Old timers there just took advantage. He had no one to pass it to. He wanted to offload. Played quickly. 
And Ben Hunt, who goes behind to Noah Brown, a long way back actually, Maguire. Oh. And then Kerr with a great pass, and Beal's in a bit of room. Another backhander, Billy for the corner. He comes back infield, then to Kerr. He keeps it wide. It's a hot potato here. It ends up with Beal. Unbelievable ball movement. Now Norman stabs a kick up. Who wants to leap? Tarek went up and comes back. It's six more. Jack Bird's there. I think the ball slipped out. It does there. It's a penalty. Hands all over the ball. All over the ball. I don't think they should take the two. They're on the attack. He's having a good year, Jack Bird. Good to see him back playing and fit and healthy. He's on the halfway. 15 seconds left in a very entertaining first half. Four and taking off. Schuster's come over to this side of the ground. Schuster's in the clear. Josh Schuster up against Sloan. Ball in one hand. Walker cussed. Oh, he gave the pass away. It still might be on. DeLui dragged down. Cherry Evans, Jake, Turbo to come back. Schuster, where do you fit him in when they're all fit and well? I think if your bench looks like Dylan Walker. Surly now. Surly. Oh, they all held off. Surly with a lovely pass. Schuster and no look. A foreign. Kieran's going to score. What a start to the second half for the Seagulls. <laughs> look at the arm go up. He punched the air as he was just scoring the try. What a great feeling that would have been for Kieran Foran supporting the whole way. Down the left-hand side. Just a team full of talent. Well, that's what it is. It's it's not structural plays. This is just footballers being footballers. Look at that. Step and draw and pass and step and sprint and offload and catch and pass. That, that's just footballers being footballers. Nothing structured about any of that. Darren Lockyer. Yeah, we just watch uh, uh, Schuster here again. He, he just He's very good at committing the man. He, he just goes hard there at Burns to create the overlap. And then here's this sort of semi-no-look pass again. That's all, all skill. And Kieran Foran, he doesn't get across the try line too often, but that's a great start for Manly. Now, Schuster, he's gone to the left edge in the back row. That's why he's over there in that movement. Ah, Ruben Garrick doesn't miss him. They've got some ball-playing options out there, Manly, now, don't they? The fifth tackle, Croker, Foran, he wants this to sit. Great kick. Great kick. And DeLui and Cade Cust can't duck through the gap. Oh, oh, Cade Cust reached out and scored! He's dropped it. Do you reckon? He's dropped yeah, it. Okay. It's going to get checked. I reckon he scored. Well, he's, he's very, very happy. Right, I reckon okay, it's come so out after he forced it. Just confirm um, the referee the says no. Let's have a look. No, no chance, no. That's oh, a try. Yeah. That's a try. Looks all right to me. That squeezes on the turf. He's really got to stick, stand it out. Oh, hasn't he stressed it? But I think he keeps his fingers on it the whole time and slap. That's a try. That's a try. Slap a Rooney. Cade Cast. I didn't think his arm was that long. <laughs> I think his arm out that far. Oh, my God. Slap. He's got to dislocate That's his shoulder. That's a try. No risk. That's a try. When his body Cade recalls, he's five metres away the from the try line. downward pressure. We have a decision. No one worries about the ball. Oh. They all want to tackle the little fella. No one wants to grab the ball. The ball's the thing. And it's only round 18. They've got Aloye on the injured list as well. Curtis Sirinen. And a couple of other long termers. But Second effort. Geez, when, they get the to, when they get that, that five. And now Jack DeBellin didn't have long on the bench, did he? A little tighten up their defence, so DeBellin back out there. Parker off a beautiful pass by Foran. Well, this is from the 1980s, this little play. What do we used to call this, Bradley? Ash? Yep. Ash? Foran holds up the ball beautifully. Looks like it's going to Schuster. Then Parker, who starts out wider, just ends up on the left hip. Have a look at this. Dummy's long. Parker finds a beautiful line. Dragons defenders are just watching. <laughs> oh, Ruben Garrick, he's nailed him. Let's go. 
Hunt now. This will come down the end goal. And the four and plays it over the back. Yeah, just... Out to Norman. And then Hunt. He's going to play long here. Gets a one-on-one. -on -one. Bird versus Harper. Bird dragged down. Just dragged down. He nearly came out the other side there and planted the ball down. Oh, Hunt tries a, a pass around the back. It's a knock on by Manley. That was clever. He must have got a call off Cody Ramsey. Have a look how far infield Jason Saab is. If he doesn't get this hand to the ball, it's a try. Come on, we've got a scrum. Six. Hopefully we get to see the play of the ball again. Oh, oh that was clever. On, They're just not changing the, the angle of attack a lot. I think they need to do more of that. Maybe here we see an early kick. Here's a kick. And Sloan's chasing after it, so is Garrick, sidelines. Oh, he got it, Tyrell Sloan. He gave a pass back. Darren Peel's going to score. Tyrell Sloan, what a play. Off the scrum, tackle one. Hunt gets the kick, Harvey Norman replay. It's a manly ball, no one's going to get it. Oh. Sloan says, no, it's not, it's mine. Comes up with the miracle ball, and Jared Beale scores in the corner. Game on. It's think, game on. I think Ben Hunt had that discussion with Tyrell Sloan. How do you want the ball, Tyrell? Look at this. Well, Ben, why don't you kick it oh. off the scrum for me? And I'll do the rest. Get smashed over the sideline. Somehow, pops out his hand, pops it back inside to Gerard Beale. Now, I think Kieran Foran's got to take over here. Just drive them forward, kick into the corners, make them go 100 metres to do it. Keep it nice and simple. Surely. Still rampaging after 75 minutes. Oh! Penalty. They can kick a penalty goal here and put it beyond doubt. I, I, th I think Dufty is a very underrated player. I think he's got points in him and I think he suits this dragon side. It's a 40-20. This kid is no doubt, no doubt, a player of the future. I guess you see to reason tonight why... They've probably seen Dufty as excess to their requirements into the future, but um, right at the moment, if they want to make the eight, I'd still be going with the experience of Dufty and his, okay. his creativity. The important win for Manly, and they're trying to keep some pressure on for top four as the Dragons shift and Hunt steps inside of Sipley and, and Cody Ramsey is tackled and that should bring the game to a conclusion. Yeah, good performance. Dragons, I guess you can say they've only got themselves to blame. They had players that could have been available tonight, but they're suspended for disciplinary reasons. And they probably took the odds and played a lot of those suspended players tonight, thinking that the Manly side would be down on troops following origin. But Manly have been able to steal themselves and get the victory. Full-time Seagulls 32 over the Dragons 18.